women may soon have something to celebrate. A male birth control pill is on its way. I think a male birth control is a great idea. I think that would be wonderful to share some responsibility. Several different studies are showing promise. One pill even mimics vitamin A deficiency, which causes men to be sterile. But the question still remains, would men take it? Yeah, I would totally take a male birth control pill. I'd take it. I don't know if the girls would believe I was taking it, though. Though many women doubt men would have enough focus to be consistent. What if he misses a day? Like, maybe that would happen a lot. Most women agree it would be great to have a male birth control pill, even if it's only used as a backup plan. <laughs> So, do you want the surgeon to do this? <laughs> yes! yes. Kind of is this the male birth control we're talking about here? Oh, that, okay, men are not going to take that pill. And just like the I, dude said, I'm oh, not going to believe he scalpel. took it. Don't scalpel? you think? Scalpel? I think Travis, would you take it consistently if you were a single guy, like, just out if he, there? If he doesn't I think it, it is yeah, really... Exactly. It is a really difficult thing to change the behaviors that you've engaged in your whole life. So if you haven't woken up every morning and taken a pill for birth control, mm -hmm. I could see guys forgetting to take a dose, yeah. but still sure. saying, oh, I'm good, I'm right. covered. Yeah. Yeah. The and problem it's not is, it's situation. You're, you're talking yeah. about pregnancy, you're still not nothing, doing nothing about STDs, though. Right. Right. But That's if you're in a committed relationship, I actually okay. think this has huge promise, because as a man, say you're married, you've had two kids, you don't want to have any more kids, the male has decided to take it upon himself. I think then, in that kind of relationship, honey, have you taken your birth control today? <laughs> yes, dear. Why, yes, dear, I have. No, well, you might want to do great, that besides but, the vasectomy, so yeah. yeah. Vasectomy, but yeah. knowing how sperm is produced in the testes, these are rapidly turning over cells affecting the testes. I'm concerned about potentially cancer, long other long-term yeah, results. Like it's not going to be that easy to just create something that may not have long-lasting negative effects. Wait, so, birth wait a second, so you said that about female birth control pills. No, so that was just going to say, yeah, men are all worried pills, about the same exact concerns. Hormones that, that what you're going to do is controlling those cells that are forming sperm, uh -huh. affecting those in some way that may have yeah, Long. I think if you're using hormones that are strong enough to stop the production of sperm, I'm worried about all the other things. Wait a minute, do why are you guys body. not worried about See, this when it comes to, to, to women? Because when you hey, get I those am. kinds of I, I, I don't like the pill personally. I mean, okay, because right. and not wait, wait, I, how, I, can, how, how can you, you like personally not like the pill? Yeah, why don't you like it? For my daughters and, and oh, my I wife, I just have a hard time with them taking hormones that have a significant alteration on their body. Oh, I actually, like birth control pills actually have a lot of health benefits yeah. for women. I wouldn't take male birth control right now until it becomes very clear that there aren't long-term health effects. Because anytime you're putting something in your body, you have to ask yourself, you know, benefit versus harm. And certainly when it comes to male birth control, <laughs> shutting it down before, I, I want to have kids. Okay.